They have an entire fudge station somewhere. So originally I was supposed to fly to Florida. However, I received a text that the flight was canceled. Well, hello and welcome back to the vlog channel. It is about almost 11 o'clock at night and I am on my way driving to Florida for what was originally going to just be like a vacation with Aaron and I and now I'm going to be going of course to house hunt and everything while I'm there but I'm here at Bucky's which is a really almost world renowned dare I say gas station so we're gonna head on inside here and I'm going to get some coffee go to the bathroom but I've been driving about seven hours nonstop. <laughs> So I'm basically at the halfway point here from Illinois to Florida. And I'm currently in Georgia right now. I think it says Adairsville, Georgia. Adairsville, Georgia. So we're going to head on inside Bucky's here. I would really like some frozen yogurt, but I don't know if they have that. But I definitely need coffee so that I can stay alert for the rest of this drive. It says that I'm going to get into Ocala at 5.30 in the morning. So... That'll be really interesting. Anyway, let's head on inside. Oh, I need to get gas too. Let's do all of that. Okay, let's go here. Ooh, what a fancy pump you are. How do you work? All right, there we are, 3621. There you go. It's so clean and bright in here too. And they got shopping carts for a gas station. And hickory cooking wood. Well, there's definitely not a shortage of coffee. So, oh, actually, that's tea. What am I talking? There's the <laughs> there's the coffee. So they got house blend. Oh, lots of house blends. Uh, dark roast. We're just gonna do a house blend, and I'll do a medium. I think. I like to not fill it up all the way anyway, especially when I'm in the car. So we'll do the house blend and. I guess it's, there we go, oh my, that is a reenactment of me in the bathroom. Hold on, let me slow that down a little bit. There we go, a little trickle will do. Now I just gotta get a lid on it and we are good. All right, so I've got the coffee and look at this, they've got cookies and what is this now? Oh, fudge. Oh yes, that's right, they have an entire fudge station somewhere. It's just huge. It is just bonkers, really goes all the way that way. There's also more over on this other side. Oh, that's right, I needed water. Should I just get a, they have cases of it. Hmm, it would be probably cheaper to get a whole case of water. But I don't have hands and I'm trying to film. Oh my goodness, I need a wheelbarrow. Okay, oh, they've also got well, wine and jerky. Just so much. Oh look, jerky, nuts, trail mix, dried fruits, and old favorites, and an ATM. I could go for a trail mix too. I wanted yogurt. Do they not have yogurt? I know, I want the one thing they probably don't have. I, w I was wanting frozen yogurt. I know there's a gas station called Trailway. No, that's not right. Raceway, and Raceway has yogurts, a slice brisket sandwich. Okay, a melt, a club melt, the sandwiches over here, oh my, they also have an entire section over here of new things you could buy, like grilling equipment, slices of wood, that's beautiful slices of wood. They did so well. Oh, rooster plates. Look at you. It says, don't ruffle my feathers. I haven't drank any of this yet because frankly, it's too hot. So, wow, it's like a whole mercantile with words on signs and everything. Okay. My goodness. I was looking for the yogurt, but I don't think they have it. Oh, marshmallows in a bag. Maybe I should get this. I mean, that looks really lovely. It's a berry yogurt parfait. They also have banana pudding. I don't want banana pudding. Oh, and salads. How beautiful you are. Wait a minute. These wraps look good too. 
I do, I do not eat this late, so this is really not something I even probably should do. You know, I think my best bet is some nuts, some trail mix nuts. Ooh, those, those grapes look so good. You ever just feel like eating a grape? They even have cheesecakes. I have not had a cheesecake in so long. What are these things that are a little ball shaped? Oh, they're cake balls. I kind of want a cheesecake. Actually, you know what I want? I want cookies. Do they have cookies? Oh, that's right. We saw a whole display of them. Let's go to the cookie section. Okay, I'm gonna get the chocolate chunk cookies. That's a lot of cookies in there. I don't even know how much they, oh, I see, $5. Oh, I was supposed to get a case of water too. I almost forgot. Okay, so I'm gonna get the, I will go get back and get the case of water and I'm gonna get the cookies and I'm gonna get my coffee. That's my purchases of the day. That's my Bucky's haul. Is that a thing, a Bucky's haul? Remember haul videos? I don't know, maybe you don't. I do. Okay, there was actually no way I was gonna be able to carry my coffee, the cookies, and a case of water. So, <laughs> I forgot that you have to use two hands on a case of water. So, I'm just gonna grab a couple of these uh, bottles to get me through the rest of my drive. They're only $2 for a couple bottles. So, that's what we're gonna do. They have a lot of drinks too, my goodness. Okay, apparently I'm just not thinking. I carried all my items over to a basket just to get me to the register. What a dork. Okay, well, I mean, I did it. I found a thing, so. Hey, they've got ice cream, Blue Bell. I don't think I can eat that in the car very easily, though. Oh, Dutch chocolate. That sounds so appealing to me. And only $3.78 for a pint. Mmm. I, I, I won't. What are these things? They're little plastic mabob, or do they, are they nutcrackers? I don't know what they are. Well, we're gonna check out now. It goes all the way down to there. Those are all gas pumps. From there all the way down to there. It's a ton of gas station pumps, oh my gosh. And it's two lanes thick, so it's this way and then it's also back there. Okay, so that added roughly 30 minutes to my ETA, but I don't know. It was great here, so I guess I will vlog again when I get back into, well, when I get to Ocala. So see you in 436 miles. All right, so it is now a few hours later. It's currently 3.22 a.m. I'm supposed to be there in about two hours, but it just occurred to me that I did not let you know at the beginning of this video why I'm driving. So originally I was supposed to fly to Florida. However, I received a text that the flight was canceled. Now, it wasn't specific to me and only my flight. In fact, it was all of the flights in a lot of places. Uh, I heard even a lot of flights that were slated to go to Florida specifically. So I'm not sure about that. I, it was a huge issue though, I, that's all I know. So yeah, really, and as soon as I found that out, I was like, okay, I'm, I'm driving. So I loaded the stuff in my car. I just thought I needed to explain this. I loaded all this Christmas stuff in my car so that I can get a jump start on moving things down to Florida. So there's a lot of Christmas stuff here. And, and, and so yeah. Well, I'm. this is the last stop that I'm gonna make before I pull into Ocala. So I'm gonna go ahead, use the bathroom, get some, get top up my fuel, might as well. Okay, time to get gas one more time before we arrive. Let's see what we got. 289, fantastic. It'll be good just to stretch for a minute, you know, because I've been in the car for a long time today. I also thought I would give a review of the coffee and the cookies. The coffee actually was really good over at Bucky's, and then I had the chocolate chip cookies. I had two of those out of, I think, five of them. Also very, very good. Good. Okay, so I'm gonna finish the trip. There's about two hours to go. So I'm just, and I'll be ready to crawl right into bed. All right, it is the next morning and I thought I'd show you a little bit about what I had in the car here packed up. So I have all of this Christmas stuff that I'm bringing down here and there's actually a couple lamps 
down there you can see I have a mid-century lamp and then also an Art Nouveau lamp. You can see the shades are up there. The one on the bottom is actually glass, like glass slag, and the other one on top is mid-century. So they're two different eras completely, but I thought I'd bring some of these items in. So that's what those are in there. And then also in the trunk, I have even more odds and ends Christmas stuff. All right, so I did get in right around the time that I said I was going to get in and I lay down. So I tried to go to sleep right when I got in and I was struggling. I struggled all night to be able to fall asleep. In fact, I don't even know if I really did sleep. I, I think I'm just really excited about today's event and that is house hunting. And so that will be, the, the, I think the next video that comes out on this channel is searching for a house. But I definitely, I just was like, I kept waking up. I was cold because I, it was cold in the room and I didn't adjust the vent or anything. I didn't think about it. And so, and then I think it was just all the caffeine that I was on. And so, yeah, I d definitely, I feel like I'm a little bit spaced out maybe. But today's gonna be a really good one because I'm just, I'm so excited to look at these houses. So if you wanna follow along and see the houses that I tour today, make sure you watch out for that next video. It's gonna be a doozy. And um, maybe, we'll, maybe we'll find the one today. Maybe I'll find the one. So all in all, I made it happen. Got here. Oh, in total, I think I'm, I was like five hours behind schedule. If you want to think of it that way, my flight was supposed to go out at 8.30 p.m. It was a budget airline. It was called Allegiant Air. I mean, my goodness, the airfare was like $140 round trip, which is really great. And then with the gas, I think I estimated that it is uh, going to cost me $160 in gas round trip. So kind of, kind of similar, really. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video. Oh, this lighting is so much better actually. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.